Hello everyone, we are your friendly neighborhood shut-ins doing the second to last part of Super Mario Galaxy. Yes, we have finally, finally getting to the end. I am XMDM. I am the Terranimator. And I'm the Doctor of Homology. We are doing the one thing coin. that nobody likes in Super Mario Galaxy, the purple coin mission. We really go through a lot for you people, you know that. Yes. Well, I, well, I went through a lot of shit. I don't know what you guys want to go through. We went through your sanity. We, we, were, your, we were your insanity. Well. So basically, all the missions are essentially you just get 100 purple coins, they're scattered everywhere. That's pretty much it. Oh yeah, and it's to get unlock these, you have to beat the final level of the game, and then you come back, and these are all here. So yeah, this is really not much to really discuss. So we're just gonna be discussing right. about other random things. Uh, For instance, body pillows. Oh god. And, and what and what it leads to when you okay. Them. This this we gotta talk about because okay. So yesterday I was on. I was somewhere, I was on, and I was bored, so I was on my phone looking at the, is the YouTube Studios little app thing, looking at our YouTube analytics, and then I found something very interesting, that for some reason, it, you know how it's displayed how people find your videos? One of the ways was that somebody had searched YouTube for Mario Galaxy Body Pillow, and somehow came across our video. Now, how in the hell that ever happened is beyond me. But I consider that the best thing that has ever happened to this channel. So when Matt showed me this on my phone and then I just I was in disbelief. <laughs> hey, like, first comes I, body pillows, then comes dolls. But it's just and Matt said best in his text. I am I am so sorry for the poor sap that was was really thinking that he was gonna see Mario Galaxy body pillows, but then he saw our videos. <laughs> because I'm sure that's not what he was expecting at all. So there are 15 uh World Coin missions. Yep. And, and some of these I speed up because they take way too long. Okay. This is plus 35 minutes long, and even then I speed up a lot of it. Okay, so... Sort of semi-montage. <laughs> sort of semi-montage for some of these. Alright. And that noise is going to be... Are great. you going to be keep spinning that fidget spinner? <laughs> I nice can't song. stop spinning! <laughs> yes, <laughs> I can! <laughs> you mean that? I'm armed! I'm armed, that's all! <laughs> I have elbows, and I'm not afraid to use them. <laughs> I do not I don't understand the concept of pain. Uh, oh, speaking of speed up. You want to test that theory? Speaking of speed up. Wish you guys could see this. Dan actually bought a fidget spinner. Give me the No, I must spin it! <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> there. Is that my room? Do not touch it for the rest of this part. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> you asshole! You'll get it after we're done recording. <laughs> so I would say remove place with fidget spinners. <laughs> <laughs> Look, there are better things to uh, use than a fidget spinner. Like if Sailor we, Moon. Uh, like Sailor Moon. Okay, so uh, anyways. Uh, uh, you know what, just for that, maybe I'll, maybe I'll take her out for a night, for a one night stand. You say the fuck word from Sailor Moon. <laughs> you say the fuck word from Okay, so She's anyway. my lady. <laughs> okay, so basically, I speed up some of these these <laughs> levels because they take way too long for me to try to find all of the purple coins in the, the levels. <laughs> Alright. So... Yeah, it looks like you're just going in a so circle. Trying to find circle. Oh, and then you found them. Yeah, I found... These, but I wasn't sure how do you get to there. So and like then Mario there. was hopping the ground. <laughs> My fidget Somebody spinner. gave Mario. <laughs> Rest in peace, Dan's fidget spinner. <laughs> Rest in peace. <laughs> or rest in peace. Right, that cost me was... 35 bucks in tokens for that thing. At Frankie's. Which is amazing why they were that expensive at Frankie's. 
because you could easily get fidget spinners at like other stores and they're less. Hey, I. Like, so pretty much all of these galaxies are either. They spent. You know, uh, there are purple coins all around the level, you have to find all of them, or. Um, We're going to get to. Or you have to get a, at all of them within a certain amount of time. Two Ooh. minutes? Yep. Well, I and say this, I think, is okay with two minutes. And they actually redesigned this entire. Well, oh, fuck it! Oh! Case in point! I, yeah, they redesigned it, and I did not expect that. <laughs> yeah. I died several times in this level <laughs> because I kept trying to use N string. Well, you get better every time. Yeah. So, uh, while we're on to a uh, different subject here, uh, so, um, remember when I said that I thought um, South Park was going to start September 11th? Yeah. I'm wrong, it's September 13th. So it's not as dark as I would think they were going to be if it said, oh, I'm going to start on September 11th. Amazing. If we... If our schedule for, for uploading goes the way that I planned... But by the time people actually see this video, it's probably going to be around November. Mm. Which I mean, you know, yeah. we do it for you guys. Yeah. You know, for those, uh, you know, that watch it. Like those five, six people who watch it who can't stream anything better. <laughs> and those sad people who get confused from our galaxies. Bye, yes. fellas. I'm sure that guy's still confused. Oh, Jesus. They weren't looking for the Bowser one, were they? <laughs> Why would someone want a Bowser one? Out of Everyone's got a kink. You know, out of curiosity, I did a YouTube search for Mario Galaxy Body Pills to see what comes up. Apparently, all videos are supposed to come up, and then it's like some a bunch of other non body pillow related video Mario videos. Wow. So. Either way, the guy was going to get disappointed. Yeah. <laughs> well, actually, no. If we look back at it, it was at like 2.8%. Yeah. yeah uh, of all the videos. Oh, this one. Oh, wow. This one. This one is evil. Yep. <laughs> this one's evil. And I magically did this on my first try. I <laughs> what? What? <laughs> No. How? I, it's not. It defies all. Dumb luck. It defies the laws of reality. Don't worry. I messed up a lot in some of the later ones. If if I've learned anything, what the fuck is a hitbox? Because <laughs> there are times where like people just bite the balls of death, and you're like, ow. So with this one. You have to crap. You have to not get electrocuted, but some will actually be underneath the. If you miss one, you, you have can... to go back. No, but you can't go back. You have to kill yourself. <laughs> wow. Almost really, like in Crash really Bandicoot. is a make or break. Really represents a make or break society, doesn't it? It's almost mm -hmm. like Crash Bandicoot insane. <laughs> oh. Ay! Wow. It's almost like Crash Bandicoot in Saint Trilogy, where you need to break every crate or something to get uh, coins. It's like that in the original Crash Bandicoot. I have the original like game for GameCube. Oh, you do? Like which which one? The uh, first one? Yeah, the original. I, I remember my only experience with no, actually it's Cortex's Revenge. What was that one? Yeah, the the my um my only experience with uh, Crash Bandicoot was uh. I don't think it was Twin Sanity. I think it was uh, the one where you can kind of like have Crash go on top of like some other monster and control that. Yeah. Whatever that game was. I'm sure Matt will probably. Either it, way, it goes to show you, kid games can be can be some of the worst nightmares a gamer can ever experience. And if I know anything about Crash, the commercials in Japanese are weird. <laughs> yeah. Commercials from Japan in general are weird. Yeah. Surprisingly, the Mario ones in Japan, I think, were not bad. The Crash ones were just weird. So, beach combing. Yeah. And he speeds. Yep, I died several times in this <laughs> level because I, there's one that's very close to it that I kept trying to grab the screen power. 
and I kept falling off and have to redo all of this again. Uh, interesting. Oh god. Although it is doing... kind of interesting when you hear the music when it's sped up. Yeah. Sorry, my, my eyes are doing the tango right now. Ah, this is very disorienting. Get used to it. Yeah, it was that one, was that. It gave me a lot of trouble because I kept trying to get it while having the spring power. It's sort of interesting that they had a spring power up in, in, in this mission. Yeah. Like, and they didn't have it for the other ones. At this point, I was like, oh shit, what are those? Two, two. Well, oh my god, I have one left. <laughs> and then you die from that. Where the fuck is it? Oh, it's right there. Are you okay. edit out all your deaths? Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> because I was about to say, like, if you did that in one try, why would you need it? The <laughs> uh, purple coins. <laughs> oh, oh, this one. In the bone pen? Yep. I don't want to go near that place. Uh, but I do. No, you don't. You don't want to get boned. You don't want to get boned. <laughs> Take it, the D train to Bone Town. <laughs> oh, in a minute. Wow. You have to grab all those purple coins with them. A uh, hundred purple coins in a minute. Oh, that's that's a bitch. One minute. No. Oh my One God. minute. One minute. <laughs> that can't possibly be correct. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, here's here, here your it is. time limit. And then it's like 30 <laughs> seconds. And I, go, ah! <laughs> I don't understand, Mr. Crash. How can you go a minute and 30 seconds in one night? In one night? <laughs> I know it's paraphrasing a sp uh, SpongeBob thing, yeah. but it still counts. Yeah. It can work for anything. Yeah. Kind of like you can use you can use wow. the. Uh, How you can do it. You only. What are, what are the things oh, that I, oh Jesus Christ Fuck. oh no no oh you're oh you're game over game over game over game over game over so what so what did Mario do you just oh I thought you I thought you just fell <laughs> I thought when trying to uh, here's the successful attempt okay at this point I had to realize that and I. Yeah, I think it's best to go down. around the edges of the... Well, it's not, outer... not just go around the edges, but sort of to not hold on to it to make it so steady, so that way you can sort of wrap around. Yeah. Um, just another SpongeBob thing that you could probably use just for about anything is if you're trying to buy something and it's like, I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it, I definitely don't need it. I need it! Because <laughs> that's people in a nutshell. Or you, or when giving a friendly advice uh, at the soap store, <laughs> doubloons. Don't wrap uh, them. Wink. What if they actually? That was a, a soap real brand called doubloons. Oh, oh! I didn't realize that just oh, because there's a that. lot of them. Yeah, you don't have yeah, to get. You don't get all of them. Oh shit! Oh shit! shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, three oh, shit. seconds left. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a win! Jesus. And it's a lot of these, you don't have to collect all the bubble coins, but you have to get collected. You have enough. to just get a hundred. <laughs> yep. They're always a hundred. Oh, uh, Gusty Guard. On the proposal cube. The oh, cube. that ought to be interesting. Oh, God. oh. I don't, yeah, I don't remember this. Oh, I, oh, I thought for a second it was gonna be like that one with the deteriorating floors. Oh, yeah. And I was thinking, oh, God, no. I, I, is there like a mission? Once again, these uh, galaxies no, defy all laws of physics. Oh, two minutes, 30 seconds. Oh, yeah, that's okay, so they're giving me some mercy. Okay, that's why I don't I don't get it. Up. You point your wand as hard as you can, but they only seem to run away from you further. <laughs> I'm pointing my wand as hard as I can. <laughs> at pretty much every fight in Harry Potter, just <laughs> pointing their wands harder. Uh, <laughs> which wand, though? <laughs> it's me. Well, it's me who commented, so you can take a wild guess, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. <laughs> what do you mean you commented? I made the one joke where it looked like you'd be a penis, which is not you. So how are you taking credit for it? <laughs> because I just did. Well, that's half. 
Yeah. I think this is gonna be okay. This I one, hope. This one, I'm not gonna have much trouble with this one. I mean, they are giving, they are merciful with giving you two minutes and thirty, which I think is enough. Yep. Unless. You, yeah. Uh, for for me, this one of my pet peeves are time limits. I, I hate time limits. Yeah. That's why. That's why when I'm at school, if I can, and the Durham Tech people are actually going to, you know, take it into consideration, which I don't even know why I even do a disability statement at all when they don't follow up on it. If they did follow up on it, I try to get unlimited time limit as much as possible in a test. Which, I guess to be fair, if your class is an hour and 15, that's pretty much a long time anyways to get something. Speaking of school, I start tomorrow, while these guys don't for a few more days. But hey, we're still going. Yeah, you're still going. Well, technically... Not going. I'm work. I'm doing it from home. Right, which is what I did this summer. Because yeah. I, because the class I withdrew from, I did not want to have. I had to take it again regardless. And I thought, screw it. I'd rather just be doing it online than rather hear somebody else t- yeah. tell me about it. And I've been working all summer. You know what I so hate about uh, like college classes, textbooks. Yeah, to pay a lot of money for textbooks. And now it's basically like an eighty dollar a mouse pad with sociology That's written cold. on it. That's cool. They just they, they, yeah, the textbooks are actually. Uh, no, no, I'm expect- saying what's cool is the fact that they even time you to get to the star. Mm-hmm. The textbooks I think are, or at least in Durham Tech, they, they're about as expensive as your own freaking tuition that you're paying for for at least a class load. But I feel like I shouldn't be this worried about these classes because they're classes that I feel like are more just gimmies. I remember my mom told me the story about how she, how in one of her classes, the teacher for the, the course summit. actually t- he made the textbook. Is this one of those? So, he, uh, so the guy actually got a lot. Uh, and also the money from the book. At this level, okay. Oh. Never. Well, he probably uh, died it's, a couple it's not of the t- It takes a while just because a lot of days are spread out, but... And I had to go in, all into different parts of the level that I didn't go through during the original playthrough. So, what... But, yeah, it's just... Uh, school's gonna be intre- uh, School's gonna be interesting because I... For two days, or two out of the four days I'm there, supposedly, it's two, it's three out of my four, and then just like Tuesday and Thursday, I only have one. And then by the time I'm finished, you know, if I don't withdraw from any of them, I only have like one class credit, and I'm probably going to just do online, so that way I'm probably going to explore some other colleges if I go into there, so I can transfer. My parents were thinking ECU or uh, Guilford, so we'll see about that. But that's just an option. Okay, look at this. You have four left, and you have to make the jump off that. Wow. And apparently there were two at the very start that you cannot see because of the camera. That's really stickish. <laughs> Alright, I don't know what how many purple coin missions we've gone through. What do you need now all these What do you need all these extra stars for anyway? Having the, these ending. For the, the, uh, after the credits, if you get all the 120 stars, you get a sort of like extra cutscene at the end that I wanted to show off. Is it a... And you also unlock Super Luigi Galaxy. Oh, no. Which we're not going to do because the we're, we're just going to... It's basically we might exact, well get it's this the exact out. same game except now with Luigi. We might as well get this out of the way. There is one final purple coin mission, but we're not going to do that. And it's very easy, it's but like, we're not going to do it because you, you, you have, have to play you have as to beat, Luigi You have to beat Super finish. Luigi Galaxy to get that. And we don't have enough patience. We've done what we said we were going to do, and ladies and gentlemen... And also, you don't want to see much. us play through this entire game again, but now it's Luigi. Yeah. Not like we hate Luigi, but it just... We, we, we've already spent enough time as it is just trying to do this, and we're just done. We pretty much what we needed to show off, so it's not... Yep, we'll be moving on to other things after this. Yep. Like when we get to South, um, South Park and Fracture Butthole. Yep. Which, in which I will have the helm again. 
Yep, and I'll probably look at a walkthrough so I know what to expect and no, stuff. No, 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 no. That spoils the point of it entirely. Well, I did that the last time with Stick of Truth, so that's well, not what I'm Don't do it. Don't do it. This time, this so this time, I'm just going in raw without knowing anything. No, nope, I'm gonna... I, you are. I'm not. Right, you know what's going on. I don't, so I'm just... <laughs> I, or, well, and Matt just wouldn't know either, so... Wait, you're sounding like I'm taking you through a, a land... a minefield filled with barbed wire. That's Mind sort of what it. South Park is. I promise I won't let you step on too many. Well, the only thing I'm really excited about is I know you pre-ordered, so you probably got Tally as a yeah. summon. <laughs> you want to get hacked? <laughs> yeah. So, let me think. After Super Mario... Other things that, that would look interest. What are some things that would look interesting after Super Mario? Um, I need to get back to like doing the room or something. If we yeah, need yeah, to. Yeah, we gotta, yeah, we gotta but, well, but again, like I said, when we do the room, I won't have Den go over there because I don't want him to suffer. <laughs> I don't want him to suffer. Unlike us, he doesn't go out of his way to play shit. I do. And I'm and I and I and I'm ashamed to. I'm way that. too good at the at the flying sections of Super Mario 64 than I'm ever any right to. <laughs> I feel like that makes too fucking yeah. much. What Super Mario 64? Yeah, the flying. Oh sections. yeah. yeah I'm well, a one time. I'm a one time after we were hanging out. The I might as well wait. Den left left before the rest of. Oh, and I found out they had the Super Mario 64 on his the, computer. The, the power was out, and so I was, we were looking on our computer for something to entertain us with, and I was just playing Super Mario 64 for Max. And there was okay. one point, and this is how bad, if you already know how bad, by now you probably know how bad Super Mario 64 is. This is truly how bad it is. He can karate chop a tank and it explodes. <laughs> like... Oh my god, that is so lazy. <laughs> Not, I mean, well, we saw it for the first time, Matt and I were laughing our asses off, but... I don't even call that try time. I'd say, you know like, flail you know and You want, You want suffering? You want suffering? You want me to suffer? Alright, how about this? The next game, Bloodborne. Boom, instant suffering. Well, that no, no one should have to tolerate Bloodborne. I do. And I'm awful at it. Well, I think anyone would actually be off by it. Have there been people who actually could play that game 100%? Plenty! Oh, jeez. <laughs> now we're gonna look stupid. I guess that's our job, I guess. Hey, I, I, hey I've gotten better at it. Like, how far have you gotten in the game without screaming at the game because... No one can do that. How many controllers have you broken? Uh... None, but I've, uh, broken two of but chairs. You, but you've come close. <laughs> Right. Oh, I was about to say, like... Hold on. Oh, yeah, this is where we had the pointless boss. <laughs> yeah. Pointless boss? Yeah, the water guy. Oh. Oof. Ow. I think it was the water guy. <laughs> yeah, it was the water guy. Yeah, who then, who right. then got a job as the electricity guy. Yeah. And then, then when that failed, he... Was fired. Fired. <laughs> I'm not giving you your paycheck this time. Aw, sir. No. <laughs> oh, the... Oh, the over here. Get over here. Get over here. You'll probably... Maybe you should also get more combat games. Uh, yeah, somewhat. Well, I mean... I'm, and maybe Injustice. Yeah, Injustice. Uh, no, I, I can do Injustice. Because I think you played through a story mode, right? Uh, I played a bit of it. Okay. Well, right. it's a uh, jump... The combat in injustices can be very nerve-wracking for me. I I can understand. <laughs> but, I mean, we don't necessarily have to like play the story mode. We could just like show up in yeah. mechanics of just like fighting. Yeah. Like a Smash Bros. thing where we don't yeah. get angry. Yeah. <laughs> we can maybe like record a let's play where we just play through various boards of Mario Party. How about how about a how about a like, yeah, how about a let's play where I take you on a driven tour of Sep Los Santos? Los okay. Santos. Oh, oh GTA. GTA. Yeah, the, yeah. The, the, the driving GTA, GTA Five. Yeah. yeah, driving portion where where Dan will crash the plane several times. <laughs> no, no, it's not driving with Dan. It's flying with Dan. <laughs> because I can driving, act you're okay. Flying, you suck at flying. <laughs> yep. I don't suck that much in No Man's Sky. 
Uh, then this is the one where we had the 25 minute yeah of of Matt uh Matt. having no sense of direction. Honestly, <laughs> I feel like Rorana R- Zoro could have found his way through this better than you could. <laughs> He's got to do a lot of flying from cloud to cloud to get these. Mm-hmm. Final Fantasy would approve. Yeah. Because it's cloud. Yeah. yeah. I don't. Well, I don't know. If, cloud, I don't know if Todd likes bees in his hair. No, I, I if, still like. Wait, if the video game's live and it comes to well, I thought he wants to just cosplay as. You're not seeing Final Fantasy VII where Cloud has to infiltrate the Bafa by dressing up in drag? Yeah. A lot of wants to cop play <laughs> Just to drag. play as Cloud in drag? Yes, Cloud in drag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That'd be funny. You may want to may wanna slim down at the hips for it, though. There we go. Just saying, don't want the enemies <laughs> turning to stone like last time. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how many purple coin missions we could, <laughs> we've gone through, but it feels like a lot. Luigi's purple coins. Wait, Luigi needs some action? No, not on oh, oh. yeah, oh, Luigi. Yeah, I'm the that, that's stuff. some weird. That's some weird fan hey, fiction if, if I ever heard. Hey, yet. if we go into warp pipe, it could have been that we were in Luigi. Yep. Fan. Let the horrible fan fiction commence. Yep. <laughs> I, I know there's probably fan fiction of anything nowadays. I tried, actually, but I couldn't come up with a good opening line. I remember someone uh, told me that like there used to be SpongeBob fan fiction, where it's like Squidward and uh, SpongeBob love each other or whatnot. Yeah. Well, like, there was one point where he said, "Oh, he liked uh, Squidward's bulge," and Mario died. <laughs> Wait, so took me several tries. Because he died from he died from Squidward's bulge. So SpongeBob loved Mario loved uh, Squidward's bulge, and well, in in the tragic and possibly looked down upon act, Mario died. Yeah, <laughs> it's somewhere Mario. Died. And well, how did Luigi take it? Uh, did he? Uh, did he go on to become mayor of uh, Mushroom Kingdom and ban seafood? I don't know. It's not making me. It's just getting weird. It's, it's not making me think of the robot. Let me change the topic. It's making me think of the robot oh. chicken thing with uh, SpongeBob, where like you know, SpongeBob pointed out that everything was uh, made of fish. Yes, he could have been made of fish. I think that's okay. At least there's nothing disgusting about a sponge. And then you see a fat guy, you know, like try to get like a sponge thing right here. Yeah. He's like, I said there's nothing. <laughs> there's nothing disgusting about a sponge. <laughs> <laughs> Like, honestly, if you're a huge fan of Robot Chicken, just watch the older versions of it, because the newer ones are not as creative. At least Thomas the Tank Engine was creative. <laughs> oh, God. What kind of cruel man would play a creature of play a game of color train of face? Yeah. <laughs> you guys tell us. It's like, at least I'm like me, I can fucking fly! <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's the end of the ru- the end of the line. Fuck it. <laughs> there it is. I gotta get find some way to get back there. Oh yeah. Well, so, good luck. So um, nerd news. Uh, so you know like. Some people do like table readings or whatnot of like, you know, scripts or whatnot, like the one you showed us of the yeah. SpongeBob cast. Well, Family Guy did one uh, that was for an episode that was never going to get aired at all. So they just wanted to do a table reading of yeah. the script that will never, of an episode that will never happen. The premise of it is that um, he sees the script. Uh, Makes or Lois sees this uh, girl that says she used to experiment when she was in college. So Peter was thinking he was gonna have a three-way with uh, Meg and uh, or I mean. <laughs> oh God! No, oh, God! Really. I can understand if that was against. I can understand why it never aired. No, no, it was Lois. 
But then um, what happened was eventually he, he finds out that that was not the reason why they were talking. The reason was that um, Lois's Lois's friend uh, was was married to somebody and they couldn't produce a child, so they wanted Lois oh. to be the surrogate. Oh, I remember now. Yeah. <laughs> so. No, actually, it, it aired. It aired. I actually the partial I've seen terms it. of endearment of endearment partial terms of endearment. No, no, actually, I I had I had I don't I lost I don't know if I could I don't know if I ever found it, but I saw the episode. On DVD, they released on DVD at some point. Oh, they did. Yeah. Oh, because at the time when I was watching on YouTube, they yeah. thought oh, we're never going to air this thing. Yeah. Oh, because well, it was never just aired on TV. Uh, I don't really know, but it's just at the time when they said it, they didn't want to like go ahead. and I can see why because it was really you could get away. Uh, the like they had really good job getting away from the FCC, but still, there's some things that are just. That shouldn't wrong. be. There's some things that just aren't meant to be joked about. Yeah. It's also one of the interesting things is that Seth Green, the guy who played Chris, he wasn't there during the table reading, so there's apparently some other guy at times that's not Seth Green who can also do Chris's impression. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's that was another thing that I found interesting. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that was pretty much the point of it, and then eventually the uh, her friend, her friend, and uh, her husband uh, died in a car crash. So then they were trying to under, uh, trying to um, un decide if they wanted to keep the kid, but low supports. But low supports. And originally, like P Peter wanted to, but then he like got tricked into thinking, oh, you shouldn't. And then that was pretty much the point. Yeah, it was sort of an interesting episode. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so sorry, the hiccups. And this is yeah. Adam West. I miss Adam West. Did you see the trailer for that new, like, 2D animated Batman? They made a 2D anime? Yeah, they did. They made a 2D animated film where uh, Batman is voiced by Adam West. Wow. Wow. And they actually made a sequel that was, and they had, and the trailer was released after Adam West's death. <clears throat> so chances are that's the last thing that Adam West participated in before he died. Uh, you got to voice the character that made it? Now you're going to oh. kill yourself because... Yeah. yeah. Just like the... I forgot what other galaxy what I was going to say. Just like the other one, you can't miss the coin. You're going to have to kill yourself. <laughs> Physics yeah. were just so disorienting as I always. still remember that one guy who was in my sort of like robotics club, and he said one time he was up at four in the morning and he uh, was watching TV and he decided to watch uh, that, like the old Adam West Batman show was on, and he said that suddenly every Mermaid Man and Bonica Boy joke made sense. <laughs> <laughs> Mermaid Man and Bonica Boy! I think the best thing that it did for Murray Man Barkle Boy was the uh, one where they did the uh, superhero one where Barkle Boy turned evil. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, every it's like, villain is Lemons, also known as Evil. <laughs> <laughs> every villain is Lemons. <laughs> Uh, and then there was like another one where they had that uh, guy. He says, "Yeah, they went to make out reef. You know, make out reef." man, make out reef. Those fiends digging the lives of innocent children. I'm uh, harassing yeah. poor hormone. Those harassing poor uh, hormonally insecure children. Ah, uh, make out reef. Good times. Good times. Do make out reef. Away. And then he falls. Is that me or not getting pizza? And I get pizza. <laughs> Or, right. No, it's it's Quickster with the ability to go really quick. It's like you want me to go over to that mountain? Want me to do it again? <laughs> All right, here's the last purple coin level. Oh, thank oh, God! Melty Molten Galaxy. Thank oh. you, Jesus. Yep. Or Jeebus. Or Jesus Crust. I pray every night for Jesus Crust. <laughs> I. Uh, you may want to pray to Haruka as well. Found him in my refrigerator one night, and well, I don't know if he'll really be, if he'll really be the same. This, this, uh, if you're going with that joke, it, it would sort of make sense with the, the Billy Joel's, uh, Only the Good Die Young. 
That makes sense. Mm -hmm. No, no. The thing is, pizza crust. Yeah. Yeah, it's just your, I thought you were talking about like some Jesus thing. No, I'm saying I ate. No, never mind. It's a, yeah, it was a stupid joke. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, just pretend that I never did that. That very last coin is bitch, because it's like right over the lot. But I have to jump. <laughs> jump. Okay. All right, there we go. Final one. All right, Xbox will actually get during the final level. 